Hello everyone, my name is Luisa. I'm a dancer with Hat National Ballet. With the situation the world is going through right now, our theater had to close the doors. And because of that, we are not able to train, to rehearse, to perform. So for a dancer, it's quite hard to stay at home and not move anymore. Uh, we are used to use our bodies every day, almost the whole day. So it's been quite challenging. And I'm here to show you a little bit what I've been doing uh, to keep in shape and to keep my body strong, because this is also very important. It's also um, important to avoid injuries. And once we start working again, that the body is not too weak to start with the whole amount of work we will have. So yeah, I'm gonna show you a little bit what I, I've been doing here. Um, I like to start my day always um, waking up my feet. They are always quite tight and cold. So I use some props um, to start mobilizing it. Um, this one is like a half ball and it's quite nice. Uh, yeah, I feel a lot under the, the foot, really uh, waking up the nerves and, and yeah, mobilizing the muscles. I do both sides and then there is this roller this little roller as well uh, it's also very good you can do the inside of the foot the outside and you can also stretch a little bit the, the cuffs it's quite nice so after I do that for a little while I also like to use the tether band for few strengthening exercises. So I can do a little bit this way. And then also just the, the toes. It's also quite nice bend and then Then you really feel the foot is starting to warm up and it starts to burn a little bit. Yeah, so then I do a couple of times uh, with both feet. And after that, I like start to wake up my, my back and the, the front of the chest. Just going around and breathing. Then both sides. Then also still waking up the, the spine. And this one is also, also a place where I feel a lot of tension. So I really like to work the rotation and the twists. And so I go this way. Turning, looking back, twisting, and then coming back, also moving the hips together. Then stretch the whole side. And then I do both sides, this way the same way. And then stretch here a couple of times. Um, then I like to lie down and start working the glutes, the core, with a little bit more strengthening. So going up. And down, really rolling the spine. Also a couple of times, and then changing the legs. Always. And 
and you can stretch your legs. So both sides the same, and it's also very nice just to go down and up with one leg. You really feel working a lot. So also both sides. Um, I like also, it's also important to work the back. So one of my favorites is facing down. This you can have a lot of different combinations to, to work the back. I like very much standing up here and twisting. So you are working strengthening and also keeping the whole spine moving. Then you can also add some bending the, the foot, so bending the leg. Um, then also stretching the arms and bending, going round, also going down and up, down and up. Then you really feel the whole back part working and also the stomach because you have to keep the hips also keep this up, not stay like that. Um, yeah, these ones, then I go to plank. You can stay here for a little bit, as long as you can. Um, then from here, I go up, and then also lift one leg, the other leg, also a couple of times, and then bending the leg, after um, yeah then once I've done those things I feel the body's working a little bit more I feel everything's a bit more awake the blood starts to circulate and then I do a couple of key raises um, always one foot normally facing the wall and hold something um, you can go, I do 16 times on each leg, very slow, you really feel working the calves and the glutes, the whole, the whole thing, also holding the stomach and it's very good to strengthen the, the ankles, the knees, the calves, everything, I really like those ones. Um, yeah, these are more or less the the exercise I like to start my day with. Um, now I can, I'm ready to, to do some Pilates, to do bar, ballet bar. Uh, the Head National is uh, streaming to us some live uh, lessons, um, ballet classes, Pilates classes. So it's very nice to be able to follow this and try to, to stay in shape as much as we can and also uh, be in touch with our colleagues because we can all see each other a little bit as well and see that we're not alone in this that we're all together uh, going through this moment and yeah I hope you enjoyed uh, stay safe in these trying times and don't forget to follow us on Instagram the National Opera and Ballet Instagram and yeah see you next time